Hey everyone, this is Derek with Get Techie. Just wanted to give you a quick tip today on how to reach online Microsoft support. Microsoft support is generally not that easy to get to, and if you don't know the correct link to go to to receive online support, it can be really difficult to get the help you need. So with that, let's go ahead and drive right into it. To get to Microsoft support, you're going to want to go to support.microsoft.com. Now, this won't direct you directly to Microsoft support. It'll give you multiple pages that you can go through first. So if you have a simple fix, of course, you can search for it. Um, and this deals with Office or 365 or Outlook or Xbox. But oftentimes, you can't find the help that you need, and especially if your product isn't um, activating or if there's some problem with a key code, you will need to reach out directly to Microsoft to get this fixed. And it won't really be helpful to go through any of these um, different forums. So what you're going to have to do is scroll down to the very bottom of the page, past all the ads and different videos that they have, and click on Contact Microsoft here at the bottom. Once you click on Contact Microsoft, it will take you to this page where you can choose the topic that you have a question about, whether it's Azure or Windows or 365. Most people's problems are either with Windows or 365, just due to the amount of products that those are out in public. Clicking on one of them, like 365, it'll direct you to another page where it will give you the option to describe your issue. So with 365, you might say, my 365 is not activating. Um, please help. And you can click on Get Help. It'll reach with some support articles, which of course you probably already went through. And then you can click on Contact Support. You might have to click a few more things, like 365, Activate, you can click Confirm. Now it'll give you the option to either call or chat Microsoft support. Chat seems to be the easiest just because it's so quick. Phone number, prepare to wait, I don't know, at least a couple of hours normally with Microsoft support. Go ahead and click on that, confirm your email. And here you are. You're ready for chat support with Microsoft. Thanks for watching. Hopefully this video helped you out.